Hello boys and girls. I hope you're all well and I hope you've been having a good week so far. Today I would like to read you a special story. But first, can you join me in singing Twinkle Twinkle Little Star? Thank you. One, two, three. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder what you are. Up above the world so high. Like a diamond in the sky. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Thank you, boys and girls. Boys and girls, today's story is called Giraffes Can't Dance by Giles Andre. Can you see the picture on the cover? That's a very interesting looking giraffe. Right, sit back, relax and enjoy the story with me. Giraffes can't dance. Gerald was a tall giraffe whose neck was long and slim. But his knees were awfully bandy and his legs were rather thin. Here's Jerry, Ger Gerald Giraffe with a long neck and long legs and he's got bandy knees, bent knees. He was very good at standing still and munching shoots of trees. But when he tried to run around, he buckled at the knees. Oh dear, oopsie, looks like Gerald's falling over. Now, every year in Africa, they hold a jungle dance where every single animal Turns up to skip and prance. Wow, look at all the animals in the jungle. Here's a jungle dance sign. And this year, when the day arrived, poor Gerald felt so sad. Because when he came to dancing, he was really very bad. Oh, shame. Gerald's feeling sad because he's not good at dancing. And all the other animals are all happy and ready for the jungle dance. Shame, poor Gerald. The warthogs started waltzing. Waltzing is a kind of a dance. And the rhinos rocked and rolled. They're also dancing, rock and, and roll. The lions danced a tango, which was elegant and bold. They all seem to be very good at their dancing, different dances. The chimps all did a cha-cha. With a very Latin feel. That's also a kind of a dance, a cha-cha. And eight baboons then teamed up for a splendid Scottish reel. So the baboons are doing a Scottish reel dance. Gerald swallowed bravely as he walked towards the floor. But the lions saw him coming and they soon began to roar. These the lions. Hey! Look at clumsy Gerald. The animals all laughed. Giraffes can't dance, you silly fool. Oh, Gerald, don't be daft. Oh, no, shame. The animals are teasing Gerald. Gerald simply froze up. He was rooted to the spot. They're right, he thought. I'm useless. Oh, I feel like such a clot. Oh, shame. Look at the sad face. He feels silly. Because they all laughed at him. So he crept off from the dance floor and he started walking home. He'd never felt so sad before. So sad and so alone. Poor Gerald. And all the other animals just laughed at him. Then he found a little clearing and he looked up at the sky. The moon can be so beautiful, he whispered with a sigh. Excuse me, coughed a cricket who had seen Gerald earlier on. But sometimes when you're different, you just need a different song. Little crickets been kind to Gerald. Listen to the swaying grass and listen to the trees. To me, the sweetest music is those branches in the breeze. 
with his cheerful eyes closed and he's listening to the cricket. So imagine that that lovely moon is playing just for you. Everything makes music if you really wanted to, said the cricket. With that, the cricket smiled and picked up his violin. That's a musical instrument. Then Gerald felt his body do the most amazing thing. His hooves had started shuffling, making circles on the ground. His neck was gently swaying and his tail was swishing around. Oh my, something amazing is happening to Gerald. He threw his arms out sideways and he swung them everywhere. Then he did a backward somersault and leapt up in the air. Wow! Gerald felt so wonderful. His mouth was open wide. I am dancing. Yes, I'm dancing. I am dancing, Gerald cried. Wow, look, he's feeling wonderful now. And there's other animals in the jungle. We're all watching Gerald dancing. Then one by one, each animal who had been there at the dance arrived while Gerald boogied on his dancing away. And watched him quite entranced. They were all so amazed watching Gerald's dancing. They shouted, it's a miracle. We must be in a dream. Gerald's the best dancer that we've ever, ever seen. So all the other animals are now amazed at Gerald's dancing. How is it you can dance like that? Please, Gerald, tell us how. But Gerald simply twizzled round and finished with a bow. Oh, look, the little, little flower was thrown, getting thrown at Gerald to say, Well done, we love your dancing. Then he raised his head and looked up at the moon and stars above. We can all dance, he said, when we find music that we love. The end. Giraffes can't dance. By girls, Andre. Now, boys and girls, can you join me in singing Hey Diddle Diddle? Let's go. Hey Diddle Diddle, the cat and the fiddle. The cow jumped over the moon. The little dog laughed to see such fun. And the dish ran away with a spoon. Thank you, boys and girls. I hope you enjoyed the story. Enjoy the rest of the week and have a great weekend. Take care and keep safe. Bye from me.